I'm excited. Okay, YouTube, I'm back. It's my initial reaction. The match just finished. It is what, uh, about 11 o'clock at night here in the UK. Italy just beat England for the Euro 2020 Championship. Real quick, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel as always. Thank you. All right, it's 7.30, 30 minutes till kickoff. We're here at my mate's house. Click here to watch the video. I'll explain five words that you have to know if you're gonna live here in England. Euros 2020, England, Italy, about to go down right now, live, right here, backyard. We set up, got the flags going, barbecue rolling. We ready, we ready, let's go. It's going down, national anthem just been sung. England, Italia, let's go, Euro 2020, let's roll. I'm just gonna give you my initial reaction, how it felt, I mean, it was gut-wrenching. No doubt, you know, I was rooting for England. Click here to watch my video and my prediction. But man, at the same time, I still was supporting Italy. As I said in plenty of my videos, I used to live in Italy. I still have friends in Italy. I mean, I just had one of my friends video message me as they were driving around the city plaza in the city that they live in and flags are flying everywhere, cars are honking. And I'm very happy for Italy. I'm just gutted for England. I mean, I'm just dreading to see what the papers are gonna say tomorrow, how everybody feels. I mean, you can just hear in this neighborhood people screaming every goal. And Get it in there! I mean, this thing went the extra innings, not extra innings, pfft. sorry, that's my American coming out of me. This thing went to penalty kicks, <laughs> penalty shots. Let's see what happens. At the end of the day, the young guys just did not come through. Oh, what the fuck? I'm a former sports guy, I've been there. I know exactly what it feels like to have a crushing defeat. All I can say is you just gotta pick yourself up and bounce back because there's another game, there's always another chance, you know, to to win. You know, it's not over. You know, sports is not only the physical, but it's the mental. It's how you bounce back. I think England has a young squad with them, and I think those guys who missed those penalty kicks, they're gonna bounce back and they're gonna come back even stronger for the next one. So whether that's the World Cup or whether that's the, um, the um, Olympics that's coming up, there's always going to be another chance. These guys are going to bring it home. I still believe that England can bring football home. This was really close and down to the wire. I mean, what an amazing match. It was funny. I went to my friend's house. I'll share a video maybe about right now of going over to my friend's house for a barbecue. Um, and I was like, I offered to barbecue. I said, I'll barbecue because, you know, the match just started. I was like, there's no way they're going to score a goal in the first two, three minutes. You know, I said, this is your sport. You watch it. You know, I'll just loosely pay attention. And I got on the barbecue. No sooner did I get on the barbecue, did they score a goal. I missed the goal. But I did catch a reaction on the replay. I'll play that right about now. And man, was it a good match. I mean, England fought really hard. Unfortunately for me, I just feel my personal, my personal feeling. I think it's a bad substitution at the end of the game where they brought in the, uh, the young kickers because they weren't in the match. They just weren't in the game. And then now they're coming in cold with two minutes to go because you know you're about to go into penalties. I think they should have done that substitution a lot earlier and we would have saw what happened. I just think, man, what a match, what a game. English should be really proud. I'm saying Forza Azzurri, you know, Forza Azzurri, let's go Italy. I mean, like I said, my heart is in Italy. I've always had my heart in Italy. It's a beautiful country with beautiful people, with uh, beautiful things to see. I'm very happy that Italy won, but I'm crushed that England lost just because I was here and that's who I said was gonna win. I thought my prediction would come true, but unfortunately it just wasn't meant to be. Go Italy, go Azzurri, um, and we'll see you on the next one, guys. This is just a quick video, my initial reaction, guys. And that's it, I'm gonna keep it short and sweet. I'm out.